my dear students i hope you all are fine and doing well i welcome you all to the math session children today we are going to study how to carry out the addition by carrying over part 2 before we start let us study some rules first arrange the numbers in the boxes according to their place value second always start adding the numbers from units place third if after adding the numbers you get two digit number then carry over the tens digit to the further place four after carrying over the number add all the numbers in that place let's take one example now in this slide you can see we have 100 2 10 and 8 units plus 200 1 10 and 6 units so let's see what we get on adding as per the rule first we will add units so on adding the units that is 8 plus 6 we get 14 units so 14 units means 1 10 and 4 units so let's take this 10 to the next place that is in the tens place and 4 units will remain in the units place only now we will add 1 10 plus 2 tens plus 1 10 so we get four tens and as it is a single digit we will not carry any number in the next place so four will be in the tens place and no carrying over here now let's add the hundreds place so 1 plus 2 we get three hundreds so the addition of the two numbers given here is 300 Four tens and four units. That is three hundred and forty-four. Let us study one more example. Two hundred and sixty-seven plus five hundred and thirty-nine. Now, according to the rule, first we will arrange them in their proper place. So two is in the hundreds place, six in the tens place, and seven will be in the units place. Plus five in the hundreds place, three in the tens place, and nine in the units place. Now first, let us add units. So seven plus nine make sixteen units. Now sixteen means one ten and six units. So we will write one in the tens place, and six will remain in the units place. Now. Let's move to the tens place. We will add one plus six plus three. We get ten. Now ten means one ten zero units. So it is two digit. So we will carry this one in the next place. That is hundreds place, and zero will be in the tens place only. Now we will add. Hundreds, so two, one plus two plus five, we get eight. So we got the answer eight hundred and six. I hope, children, you all must have understood how to carry out the addition by carrying over. Children, study all the rules properly, and practice. more sums to understand better so keep practicing and keep learning thank you